folks, but you know it is possible to make some of your favorite restaurant foods at home. It certainly is. It's, of course, easier, it's cheaper, but the question is, what about taste? Our Ooh. resident chef here, consumer That's athlete right. Jonathan Walsh, here with the answer. Well, you know what? I love shamrock shakes from McDonald's, but you can only get them at certain times of the year. Not anymore. We teamed up with copycat.com, copycat, cat with a K, dot com, to find out how to make shamrock shakes and so much more. First, let's check it out. You got four scoops of ice cream, put it into the mixer there. You got a half cup of half and half. Get that in there right there. No calories. A couple in that. of splashes <laughs> of mint extract, okay? And then if you want to, you can throw in a little bit of green food coloring. Okay. Just for added value. Real deal. So what we're going to do, we're going to mix this up. And after we give you more copycat recipes, these guys are going to do a live taste test. Stick around. People love avocado. Travis Hawk is a cooking student at Polaris Career Center. He's making guacamole that's supposed to be just like Chipotle's guac. People love that, too. Chipotle's known for their organic and quality material and the amount of effort they put into it. Travis is following a recipe from copycat.com, a website that claims to have the recipes to your favorite restaurant foods. Honestly, really simple. Three large avocados. Cut around the seeds and remove them. Spoon out the meat. Mince half a red onion, one jalapeno pepper, and one clove of garlic. Pinch of salt to taste and two tablespoons of lime juice. Hand mix it all. Travis showed us it takes five minutes to make. And you have a guacamole, Chipotle will cry for. After a blind taste test, our tasters couldn't tell the difference. Which one do you think is from Chipotle? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. What do you think? Um, I kind of think the, think the second one is. The Chipotle guac was number one. Cost for one cup from Chipotle is $2.95 with chips. The batch that Travis made without chips was $6.74, but it made five servings. The average per serving, $1.35. How about a meal? Breakfast, buttermilk pancakes from IHOP. Using the copycat recipe, senior student Brianna Spence says it took her five minutes of prep time and cook time, about two minutes per pancake. So that's about the color that you're looking for. So nice golden brown. We had fellow student Allie Lear taste the IHOP and Brianna's pancakes. In our unscientific test, she chose Brianna's. I personally think these are better. No kidding. Yeah, they're fluffier and crispier. Cost at IHOP, $5.99 for five pancakes. Brianna's average, $2.28 for five. It's pretty simple. I think anyone can do it. And how about lunch or dinner? Applebee's grilled chicken oriental salad is one of that restaurant's most popular meals. I think it's very nice, nice flavors. I love Asian cuisine. Senior Polaris student Katerina Liska is replicating the dish with chopped romaine lettuce, shredded cabbage, shredded carrots, twisted almonds, crispy noodles, and chicken already prepared. That's on copycat.com. Now to the secret behind the salad. Right. The salad dressing. Katerina says it's a half cup of mayonnaise, a dash of honey, a little bit of rice vinegar, a tablespoon of Grey Poupon, and one half cup of water. Our tasters enjoyed both salads, but liked Katerina's more. Cost from Applebee's, $9.79. Doing it on your own, $5.61. Plus you feel better about it if you make it yourself. All right, we have a whole interactive map talking about a ton of more copycat recipes that you can do at home. We have extra special video mm. with another great that recipe. And that all is under newsnet5.com. Hold on, guys. Here we go. Oh, shot of that. Under yes. the consumer section. <laughs> there it is. Now, Cheers. go ahead and taste a little bit. I'm going to grab this one. Oh, 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 oh. Johnson getting in more here. With cream. <laughs> more whipped cream. More whipped cream. There you go. Oh, this looks mm. great. Bottoms up. Mm. Delicious. Mm. Wow. That's the result. Mm. You know what? It's pretty good. Thumbs up. Awesome. Mm. And there you have it. You yeah. can do this at home. Yeah. Easy breezy. Takes about five, ten minutes. Go. Jonathan McWalsh. <laughs> <laughs> it's top of the morning, too. I know. I could have used more cowbell. <laughs> All right. Let's go this way. Come on. Let's talk about the weather while they're having